Cheer, brother. Yeah. Oh, that's good to hear. Yeah. Yeah. Here we are, team. We're on the job. Camo yeah, and Joe have just arrived. Sean's here as well. Digger's just showed up. Uh, I've got the trailer and picked up our wire mesh and some rebar. Got the trusty Subaru sacked out. So this is the job. So we're doing a approach coming into the garage. So it's about a one and a half meter approach off the garage. All the way along there. And then also we've showed up this morning and the clients asked for some extra concrete. They want to fill this space in along here. You can see where they want to go. Down here, down to the existing pathway down there. And they want exposed on this little piece here. So be good, bit of exposed for the YouTube. Got a beautiful property here, so we have to uh, make sure we do a good clean up and leave a good job, like always. Got the dogs here, Niggs and Ziggy. A bit of behave, eh? There's other dogs here. Sounding very professional, boys, eh? <laughs> then we use Pythagoras. <laughs> and how does A that squared plus B squared equals D squared. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> yeah, no, we're just getting measurements uh, all ready for the uh, wire mesh, guys. No, enjoying the uh, concrete today. Um, it's all about steps. It's a bit like fencing, eh? Like, you're always trying to think ahead of what's next. That's what I'm enjoying about the job. Nice work, brothers. So we just got an extra little pad out the back here, three and a half meters by 1.5. It's come up nicely, so we're just waiting for our uh, What's that measurement again, bro? stone. <laughs> Cam's gone to the yard to pick up some crusher dust and the compactor, and we're good to go. Here's the progress, guys. Last steps. Throwing in a bit of crusher dust, get us up to our final elevation. Got the builder here, building a wall or something. What do you call this, bro? The retaining Great Wall of wall. China? Oh, retaining wall, yeah, the greatest yep. of retaining walls. Yep, beautiful. Engineer spectively. Nice. Mega structures. Mega structures 101 right there, boys. Are we starting this footpath too? And then you want to put one in the front. And do you put any of these here yeah, inside one? Some yeah, so I run inside, inside on the opposite. So each one has one on the inside opposite to hold the angle. And then when we come along with the concrete, that'll hold it in place. So we'll chuck one about here, bro. Yeah, bro. Yep. So basically I just either side up one side on the left hand side was the 
side that I chose to just eye up and follow the radius and I sort of just try to find a nice looking curve and then just use a timber cut to the distance of the pathway which was one meter and just go along in intervals and um, space it out throw Sean's down here finishing off the rest of the cut that's our, and loading uh, up the truck that's our builder slash digger driver slash gardener concreter whatever what else is other trades you got there bro fencer I can't say on national TV, brother. <laughs> <laughs> well, he was talking about Karma Shutra in the yeah, last video, eh? So, well, uh, if anyone's listening out there, you know, <laughs> want to join a club? <laughs> yeah. Nah, yeah, Sean's a bloody good worker. He's a jack of all trades, this fella. I won't say he's a master of none because I know he's pretty sharp. Oh, <laughs> so. I don't know. Nah, I've making been good progress. For 50 years, but... <laughs> Not looking good, boys. That beer's tasting good too. Got some beautiful garden around this property. Nice. So there it is, guys. There's a start. Come into a bit of a curve. A bit of an S bend through here. Haven't finished prepping this. We've still got to put some uh, pegs along this side. Just run out. It's the end of the day, it's four o'clock, so boys are knocking off. Got a pad here, got to blend into the shed there. And then back around to this little garden shed. And then just to match up with the driveway out here. But yeah, no, happy with the, today's mahi. Got this one all prepped for concrete. And we'll be back tomorrow to continue boxing this one off. And hopefully we might have concrete midday tomorrow. Morning team, back on site. Uh, we got concrete this morning. Well, it's coming at about 10 a.m. Boys have just been uh, doing a few little jobs, tidying things up, getting ready, and uh, just preparing in the back there our second pour. We won't be pouring that today, that exposed aggregate. We'll uh, leave that until we've got a full day and a full crew on. We've just got uh, Sean, Magman, and uh, brother Joe and brother camo so yeah bro joe's got his drone out today he's gonna get a few shots and uh do a little bit of filming for us again and hopefully we might be able to get him on the tools today bit of a <laughs> bit of a learning <laughs> learning day training day bro reckons is a little bit worse for wear had a bit of a big night with uh, one of the bros playing some darts so, yep Nah, stay tuned boys. That's us, we'll get into it. Concrete is here, brothers. We are on. Sun's out, guns out. What's that meant to be, bro, Monday? Yeah, now we have a little bit of water, please, mate. Say so his hands getting up, bro. Mean that's us, concrete's all in. Bros just starting on the edges, magging up. Oh, concrete was uh, a little bit bony today, <laughs> had to add a little bit of water, and yeah, nah, it just wouldn't cream up. The concrete mix in New Zealand's generally quite rough. The uh, stone mix is a 19 mil, and uh, sometimes I feel like the stone in it's man 30 to 40 mil but uh yeah we deal with what we got
There it is, guys. Last finishing touches to put the broom on. Woo! What do you reckon, Charlie? Bare feet on the old job site, bro. I bet you don't get that in Macedon Ranges. That is that. Nice. Nice. Pretty good finish. Pretty sunny and hot out here today. It's supposed to be 25, 26 degrees. Just got our last little piece out the back in the shade. That's three times, but only yeah. once today. Oh, is that oh, there? Oh, okay. <laughs> I just thought it was over a 48 hour work period. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh. So we're just ripping these forms off on this side and uh, I'm sorry, bro. Yeah. we're going to uh, face this edge. It's going to be, visi uh, it's going to be visible from uh, this side. So try and put a finish on it. 